Brian? Yes. There's something I have that you want. Not? Yes. All right, listen here. I don't know who you are, I don't know what you want. If you're looking for ransom, I can tell you I have no money. But what I do have are a very particular set of skills. Skills I've acquired over a very long career. Skills that make me a nightmare for people like you. If you return what is mine, that'll be the end of it. But if you don't, I will look for you. I will find you. And I will kill you. Then I will hunt down your family and kill them. Then your pets, co-workers, even that waitress you've been eyeing at the Red Lobster. You know that fuzzy little squirrel you've been feeding birdseed to? I'll kill him and all his fuzzy grandchildren. Then I'll kill the birds, every crow, lark, and starling on the whole eastern seaboard. Maybe even a few seagulls. A couple of fish as well. And, when it's all said and done, I'll dig up the rotting corpses, use the Necronomicon, bring them back to life just so I can kill them all over again. Only this time, I'll throw in a few orphans and some kittens. Dude, I just wanted to give you your pizza. No, oh, is it here? I'm at the front door. <laughs> You're a dick. Hey, that's 1573. I told you, I don't have any money. However, would you be interested in a very particular set of skills? Your loss. I think it works. Got to the point? Yeah. So, how'd we do? Well, they liked the brevity of it. Perfect! But they thought it was short on story. What's to complain about? A guy orders a pizza, he gets it. I know we called it taken and delivered, but I think we delivered a little too quickly. I knew we should have had the pizza arrive late. It would have built tension. I just don't think ransoming a pizza is much to hinge a plot on. Maybe if it was a lasagna? Or a human! Ick. This isn't Silence of the Lambs. Actually, Hannibal Lecter delivering pizzas isn't such a bad idea. We'll save it for Christmas. Anyway, we got Thanksgiving coming up. Now, in honor of the occasion, I was thinking something that was timeless, classic, and a little nostalgic. Let's say Wreck-It Ralph. Hey, let's say no. What? Why not? It's Thanksgiving, Donnie. So? We have a life. We're tired. We could use the day off. Oh, and what are you going to do on Thanksgiving? Stuff. And you? More. Stuff. You guys don't have anything planned, do you? Don't you have a wife? She's with relatives. Then why are you here? It was part of the prenup. And what about your family? They were part of the prenup, too. That's one big prenup. <laughs> yeah, it was kind of a big family affair. Everybody was invited to talk about it, except me. So it doesn't matter. You're the only thing I got, so please. I tell you what. If we can't find something else to do, then we'll do it. But that's not a guarantee. And we will find something to do. Hey, Mom. No, it's me. No, the other one. Um, that's your cousin. Sister. Come on, Skype, don't fail me now. Um, Mom, Dad, what are you doing for Thanksgiving? Paris. Don't suppose you have... In case you're wondering, we don't have an extra ticket. Niece. Dog! Yes! Yes, hey, I, I just figured that we should... No, no! I shouldn't have to pay to talk to my own mother. Yeah, all right. That seems fine. Uh, 99 cents for the first minute, two dollars each additional minute. Saw your video online. Well, as you can see, my acting career is keeping me busy. It looks like America's Funniest Home Videos. Well, at least you laughed. No, that seems fair. Uh, yeah, go, go ahead and get an oven timer. See, she's searching her kitchen. And searching. And search. This could take a minute. Let, I'm gonna check my bank account. Was it supposed to be a comedy? Yes. Needs work. Love you too. I think I hear a lawnmower. Can I ask?
ask you something? Yeah. Is this what you thought you'd be doing with your life? Well, my family never thought so. You don't talk about them much. My dad was into sports medical equipment. They called him the jockstrap king. Did you work for him? For a while. You see, the thing is, I was an investigative journalist. Really? Oh yeah, fresh out of college, I won my first Pulitzer. Exposed one of the biggest Ponzi schemes in the Pacific Northwest. Even sent the ringleader to jail. Your father must be so proud. My father was the ringleader. Oh. Yeah. Apparently the world of jockstraps is a seedy den of sin and corruption. Or do you still talk to them? Holidays, mostly. Which is really awkward. Dinner usually ends up with my cousins throwing congealed cranberry sauce at my face. And balls. Ew. Yeah, especially since I don't get those free jack straps anymore. Uh, how about your family? Oh, mine? They don't agree with my career choices. Which one? All of them. Well, some people take a while to figure out what job is right for them. That's what I said, but apparently 42 is their limit. Well, at least you're not hurting anybody. And that's why I like it here. You know, this place is kind of removed from the rest of reality. Hey, uh, does this look like Wreck-It Ralph's hand? I don't know, kind of looks like Wreck-It Ralph if he got bitten by vampire witches. So call me a vampire witches! Really removed from reality. Well, I hope things work out with your family. Me too. Alright, Donnie, you got us. Here's what I've got so far. Wonderful! Donnie, I don't think I can do this. What? Why not? I can't play a character from a game called Sugar Rush. I'm exhausted. The tenants had me up all night watching the place. Something about bad blood and the Tatalias. Alright, look, we're a professional film crew Thingy production. I'm sure we can find something to fight fatigue. And this is for our cranky Fraulein. There isn't caffeine in it, right? I can't do caffeine. Why not? It would be bad. Nonsense. This is perfectly safe. What is it? Brunhilde's homebrow. It's... chewy. Oh yeah, you may need this. So... what's in it? Imported Turkish coffee, three Red Bulls, a pound of sugar, and my secret weapon, Luftwaffe lozenges. What? Mesamphetamines. What? We used to give them to our MiG pilots to keep them in the air for three days. One of these and she'll be riding like the Valkyries. How many did you put in there? Enough. Jesus, man! Strecken Sie! Wait five seconds. Eins, zwei, drei, vier, und jetzt! What are you guys standing around for? Let's shoot this fucker! Now? Yeah, you're gonna do it in like 20 minutes! You don't even have the script memorized. Done! Bull crap. C12, line three. Come on, Ralph, we can do it if we really try! That's correct. Of course it is! But why are you guys talking to me over here when I'm already over there? That's amazing! That's German engineering. Well, now that I've left the world of copyrighted characters, perhaps I can relax for a while without paying through the nose. So what's the name of this here place? Sugar Rush, by God, looks like if Candyland farted out Mario Kart. Oh hey, little girl! What's your name? I'm just a glitch, glitch, glitch. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. You're just a mistake, a hack, a bug in our perfect little world. You don't belong here. That's not fair. You need work. I need work. You need work. Not as much as you. Stop it. Work, 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 work. Hello, sweetie. What have you done with your life? Shut up, Mom! Well, I'm Ralph. Boy, Rebecca, I gotta say, you really got this glitch character down. You're so hyper and energized. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. Well, you know, I, I didn't know where any of that stuff was in the script, but at the same time, it's good to give every character a backstory. I'll tell you what, uh, I'm gonna check out the props for the hero's duty scene. Why don't you look over the bit for the commander, okay? I can hear the people sing, Lost in the Valley of the Night! Okay! <laughs> As requested, one angry bird. Hi, that's one angry looking bird. It's a turkey. Yeah. Okay, that works. 
what are you going to do with the turkey? Herald Director wants an angry bird for his video game movie. Something about flying aliens. Why is there a camera on its head? So when we launch it via catapult, we can get its point of view. Oh yeah, you will believe the turkey can fly. That doesn't sound very PETA friendly. I have a net. Trust us, we've done this plenty of times before. The answer will only make you cry. Oh boy, these high-def video games sure are different from my 8-bit world. What should we do, Dynamite Gal? Shoot the Abraham Man! Um, what? You heard me! I think you meant Angry Bird. You don't know me! Um, I think we should... Shut up, Dad! Danny! God! Okay, Rebecca, uh, I don't know what angle you're going with, but the commander is a badass leader who sticks to the script. So why don't we try that, okay? Your words become colors when they leave your lips. Okay? So I hear you were married? Oh, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Little Miss Perfect being some doctor's housewife. You want a meatloaf while you're at it? Yes. No. Got. So aliens attacked your wedding. You sure it wasn't one of the mini school plays you missed? God. So you were never married. Of course not, because you never liked anyone I brought home. Admit it! Admit it! Who are you talking to? Admit it! God. Maybe if you didn't leave me in the same room as Uncle Frank for 20 minutes, I'd be more normal. Wait, what? God. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so scared. I think we should cut. So what do you think we should do? I think our only hope is to have a sit down with Uncle Frank. But what are we going to do with the scene? Travel back in time in a time machine made out of my nose hairs with a backwards yodeling ukulele player. Uh, I think it fits in. <laughs> I don't understand why there is all this hatred for Thanksgiving. <laughs> Feasting, to drinking, getting together and being miserable to each other. Those are all proper German values. <laughs> And of course, there's also the animals to be bred and slaughtered. <laughs> that is where you come in, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Can you move? I feel like a statue of Lenin. Nobody puts her arse on my friend. I'm gonna go get her! Nine, Quinn! It's too dangerous! I got engaged. Aliens attacked my wedding. I fended them off. And last but not least... They're having a problem! And it's gone forever. God! Alright, there's just a little bit more right then. Oh, okay. 
so let me get this straight. My stump bird is roaming free throughout the studio? <sighs> yeah. Well, where's Quinn? Save the drivers! Help me! Shut up! It's a kitchen. Why the pipes, the pipes are cold. Oh, still. As I feared, he has contracted vampiric bird flu. Wait, what the hell kind of turkey sucks blood and gives you the flu? <sighs> Only the cheapest of birds imported from the most disease-infested dirt farms tended by the shadiest gypsies in all of Romania. And where'd you get this one from? That is privileged information. Suffice it to say, it was a pretty good deal. Ah. Well, wait, how come you're not infected? I'm German. It will take the virus a while to defeat my iron blood. But when it does... What then? Ever seen Downfall? The last days of Hitler? Yeah. That. Well, what do we do? Where is it now? Hey, boy, what's that? The tenants! My master! Hey, did somebody order a thirsty? What the hell is it doing? Oh, good. oh good, I thought they were in trouble. Donnie, we've got to stop it. No, Carl has to stop it. I'll help him. <sighs> no, I need you to finish the speech for Wreck-It Ralph. You have to find a way to tie everything back to the Thanksgiving spirit. Thanksgiving sucks. It's nothing but a bunch of like-minded individuals getting together and judging everyone because it makes themselves feel big. We have the internet for that. Besides, that's what the holiday is about. Helping our fellow jur... man. <sighs> Fine. Rebecca, you and I are finishing the movie together. But Donnie, isn't he also Fix-It Felix? How are we gonna get around that? So, Fix-It Felix Jr., I see that despite me, you change your skin color from white to black back to white again and then grew a goatee very similar to mine just to make me more angry that you look like me. All the stuff you just said is true. Well, I have purpose now. There's a little girl who wants to win a race and I'm gonna help her. Isn't that right, little... <laughs> How the hell did you get on the ceiling? <laughs> I wish you could go with me. I am too sick. But what if I fail? Don't worry. You are in the military now. Should you die, someone will come and replace you. Now go, my friend. Ow! Raus! Don't fear no bird. Okay, I'm not too sure what turkey steps sound like, but I'm pretty sure I heard them back there. I know you're out there, you buzzard bastard! Show yourself! <gasps> what the hell? She cut the power? Son of a bitch, she cut the power! How can they do that? They're animals! Whoa! Oh. This is the sticky shit. Just gave birth. Peaches are fuzzy. Carl! Where's the coma? Uh, swing low, sweet chariot. That's it. I'm going in! Do not worry, should you die, someone else will replace you. Really? Nine, you are our last hope. What about Donnie? As I said, you are our last hope. Right. I'm ready! Let's do this! Let's do this! So good. Now, you will need this device to- Well, now that I have this big, empty building to myself, I can take the time to contemplate in silence. Complete and total silence. <laughs> the serenity I have right now will be so unbelievable, so I can meditate on my exact Captain's log, second hour. 
They have entered the third stage. The gobbles. Carl, what? What's going on here? Where's Rebecca? Running around in circles, no doubt. Tacoma! 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 Honey. The spray up. Oh, no, it's okay. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. No. It's done. With the speech. It may need a little work. No, I can't leave you. No, it's fine. All I've ever wanted to do was to make somebody proud. Finish the story. I shall avenge you. It bit just yourself. So, the mastermind behind the whole video game takeover was. That's a light. It's a me, Mario. <laughs> but why? Huh? Because he feels the need to be in every single game, no matter how pointless. That's a light. And this time you have no more the nose hairs to make it the time machine. Oh, backwards yodeling science, you failed us. What are we gonna do, Felix? I don't know. What are we gonna do, Glitch? I don't know. What are we gonna do, Commander Lady? I'll tell you. What we're gonna do? We... we're... just die. Where's the Tylenol? V-Bold, V-Bold, Brunhilde. My friends, as we celebrate another year, let's not forget those who we have cast aside. Sure, a lot of us have made mistakes in the past, but in the end, what we're fighting for isn't a medal, isn't a race, isn't a gold coin. It's fighting for our friends. Think we're safe? Not unless they've figured out how to open doors. had to say it, didn't you? And you know those friends. They're the people you can always be with, even at times when nobody else seems to be. And when those friends look at some of those lonely souls and decide that even though nobody else wants them, that they'll still come together just for the sake of being together, that's when you know you have more than just friends. You have a family. Listen, I don't even own this asshole. I don't even eat turkeys. I'm a vegetarian! Wait to sell out your comrades. It may not always be the best family, but it's okay. Because it's your family. Because in the end, they realize that I am bad. And that's good. I'm not good. And that's not bad. Welcome in, bad demon. You have traveled far to collect a debt. But I will go down with my shipmates. A lifetime of killing all creatures great and small finally atoned for. Because when you get down to it, what is family? Hey, turkey! Gobble this! Family is love. <laughs> family is kindness. <laughs> family is friendship. <laughs> Family is the need to help all living creatures. <laughs> and I am proud to be in this family. Happy Thanksgiving, Mother Clucker! Holy smokes, what the hell happened here? I killed the turkey. Oh, that's great, where is it? I think I ate it. You ate the turkey? I don't know. It's all a little blurry. I 
I think I'm on a sugar crash. Or a food coma. It's like six pounds of tryptophan. I may have also eaten some eggs. 700 pounds to be exact. I don't feel so good. Donnie, did you finish the script? Yeah, yeah, I finished it. What a way to celebrate Thanksgiving, huh? Yeah. So now what? Dear Lord, please bless this bountiful TV dinner and the many preservatives that went into making it. May it nourish us and... Apparently help us survive a nuclear blast. Hmm, amen. 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 <sighs> It'll be fine. Just give us six weeks. Oh, okay. Science so preservatives. Greetings, Internet. I am the leader of SWAG, the Swede Actors Guild. We specialize in remaking movies inspired by the cinematic not blockbuster Be Kind Rewind. I come here not to reward, but to punish an organization that has threatened our very existence. Demo Reel. These hacks, led by one, Dami Dupre, represent a grave threat to the guild. Besides being really sucky, even by our standards, they have continued to thumb their noses at us. Hacks like these give us a bad name. They cheapen the very cheap foundations on which our art is based. That is why you must heed my warning. Avoid Demo Reel at all costs and destroy Donnie Dupre. That is all. Oh, and also, please join us this Thursday for our annual Swags Gimme Potluck. Remember, there will be a raffle, so bring your cash and your sense of fun. That is all. Again.